Hi everybody, my name is Gene. I'm a graphic designer and I'm an illustrator. I've been working in the industry for about the last 15 years and we're continuing our paper craft series but it's also kind of a sock craft. Uh, we're getting a little crafty with some socks and some paper and I'm going to show you uh, just in time for the holidays how to make a sock and paper snowman. Sock and toilet paper. So that's kind of paper and it still fits into our paper craft series. So trust me, this one's going to be interesting. Alright guys, let's get started. So before you go raiding the toilet and dad's sock drawer, kids, make sure you get mom and dad's permission because you probably don't want to be running toilet paper all over the house. Because, um, yeah, that's, people actually have to pay for that. One day you'll learn about a job and having a job. But for now, just live in blissful ignorance and ask mom about using the toilet paper and dad's socks. Because the other thing is, too, if you don't just... Uh, grab a sock and you ask mom for one, she could probably get you one without a hole in it. But dad probably has a bunch of these lying around with some holes in it. Um, yeah. Anyway, okay. Toilet paper and sock snowman. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to grab a bunch of toilet paper. So we're just going to unroll it here. And you want to ball it up. Okay, grab a bunch of toilet paper and we're going to ball it up. And then we're just going to stuff it inside the sock. Okay. So get a bunch of toilet paper, and if you need more, grab more. That's fine. And you want to make it so it's about, I would say, a quarter the size of the entire length of the sock. And grab a rubber band, or in this case, I'm going to use some duct tape. And I'm, going to, I'm just going to twist this off a little bit here and use some duct tape to hold it in place. There we go. See, now if you want, and you probably, probably not with the duct tape here, but if you want, for Halloween, you can take the snowman and just turn it into a ghost. And then you've got like a little ghost with a head for Halloween. But this is not for Halloween, this is for Christmas. So now, we're gonna grab some more toilet paper. Just grab a bunch that you can ball it up. Ball it up nice and good. And stuff it into the top of the sock there. There you go. And now, when you're, when you're twisting off the bottom part of this one, Make sure that it's right about the same location on the bottom that you twist it off the one on the top. Because you could, it's possible to twist it off to the side. You don't want to do that. You just want to be as careful as you can and twist it off. Otherwise, it's going to be a weird looking snowman. So we're just going to twist this off. Grab some more duct tape. Bam. Perfect. Look at that. Duct tape works wonders. Okay. So now you can see we've got the, the first parts of the fixings for the snowman. And what do we do? We grab some more toilet paper and we just sort of ball it up, stuff it in there real good. And in this case, I've got just an old shirt that was lying around that's white that we can use as a base to, uh, to help this guy stand up. So I'm going to spread this out. There you go. And there is sort of the beginning of your toilet paper and sock snowman. You can see we have the head and then the torso and then the legs. Uh, if you want to put a face on it, you can grab a marker and you can just give it some eyes and a nose. You can grab some orange construction paper if you have some lying around. Give it a little, uh, a little carrot nose. There we go. We can. Uh, Got a little carrot nose here, we can, we can tape that on or, or glue it on. But again, make sure that you're not using dad's best socks for this. Uh, you know, we give it a couple buttons and then, uh, then your snowman's done. So there it is. There, I bet you never thought that you would be doing that with a sock and toilet paper. But, you know, get crafty, man. Anything that you see around the house, you can use for a purpose for which it was not intended. So you just have to get a little bit creative, and like we just now did, you can make a sock and toilet paper snowman. So I hope you guys had a lot of fun, and I'll see you next time.